All right. Hey, what's going on, everyone? This is Caroline Karanja. I'm Josh Thelman. And we want to thank you all for coming out to check this out and check out these six amazing companies. We're sure tonight is going to be a night you're not going to forget. All right. So as Caroline is getting ready to show you, we are 26 Letters, your one-stop shop for building an inclusive and engaging work environment. Our SaaS platform produces insights and analytics which help you attract, retrain, or retain, and grow top talent in the modern workforce. So let's say in my organization, we're really interested in understanding where we stand in terms of diversity and inclusion and engagement, right? So we can go ahead and have everyone take the short survey or organization assessment. Uh, and then once we have all of that data, our dashboard will load. As you can see here, the dashboard gives us a really nice baseline in terms of where we are when it comes to employee inclusion and employee engagement. And it also gives us some key takeaways and highlights from that survey. So rather than giving you a whole bunch of the data, we're just pulling out the really important pieces. And then of course, we have the um, insight section, which is really where we get to take a note of all the things that are happening. So this focuses on three core areas around community, culture, and the people who are in the organization. You have filters there that you can um, go ahead and really kind of drill down on the data. And so the organization who's taking the survey will actually decide what those filters look like because every organization is different. And the reason that these filters are really important is because people have different experiences within the organization. And being able to narrow it down this way means that you can start to really uh, see those areas of opportunities as well as those areas of strength that um, really make your organization what it is. So we have all this data. And um, it's great. Josh. Um, wait. Uh, so can we go back a page? Uh, so one of the reasons that we're looking at inclusion engagement is because those are two really core pieces of the organization. Right? And so we know that organizations that are more inclusive have a higher um, ROI. We know organizations that are more engaged have a higher um, ROI. And so uh, now that I have all that data, I can go ahead and go to the initiatives library. And so what this is is a really nice uh, uh, library of all of the different action steps that you can take with the data that you now have provided for your organization. And so in the back end, we're storing all of this data, all of these initiatives, and they're based off of research data and a past client work um, and the insights that we've gathered from that. So when um, you go ahead and create an initiative based on our prior information, we can just pull on some of the um, initiatives that we already have stored in the, in the back end. Caroline. Yeah, Josh? Did you know that in a recent Gallup poll, only 30% of employees said they were fully engaged at work? Only 30%? What were they doing that other 70%? Mm -hmm. hmm, think about that. Um, so these initiatives range from a number of different efforts around people, around culture, around uh, your hiring initiatives, your onboarding, all those different pieces. Perfect. All right, so let's say I'm new to your organization. So one of the things that I do is I fill out my profile, and this is where people can find out more information about me. And so this will also help me in terms of integrating to your company culture. I can learn more about my coworkers. And also, it gives, you an it gives me an opportunity to find points of connection with other employees. And let's say I have a meeting with Josh, right? Josh is the CMO at your organization. Uh, so I can go to Josh's profile and look around and know, you know what are the best ways to connect with him, um, what is he looking for. Uh, in terms of meetings and work style, things like that. Uh, and of course, as it turns out, he really loves to collect rocks, which I do as well. So it can be a conversation starter between me and the CMO. Every organization, whether they realize it or not, is somewhere on this continuum of workplace culture. A positive environment can help attract the most promising talent, help you retain and develop those individuals so that one day they're ready to lead, but lead with strong values and convictions. Uh, so thank you, Mini Demo, for the opportunity to present, and thank you all for joining us today. 
uh, if you want to learn more about 26 letters and how it can work for your organization increasing, increasing inclusion engagement, f go ahead and um, connect with us through 26letters.co or just email us at hello at 26letters or you can just come up and talk to us in person. Thanks.